Good morning everybody. I know this one's a little bit of a late one and um, please forgive my sunglasses. I'm not trying to look cool or anything. It's just I can barely read the pages on my Bible because it's so bright and glary out here. Um, about to head off to church soon. Um, we've got a prayer meeting at 9 o'clock. So here's our devotion for today. We're on day 21, so we're past the halfway mark. We've got 19 more days left of fasting and praying and, and pushing forward towards the things of the Lord. And uh, praise God, uh, there's been change happening, there's been shifts happening in people's lives, um, and uh, good good spiritual ones, not just what's happening out there in the world. Um, but I've got a word for you today, and it's kind of like a pr my prayer for you guys. Uh, so this is, comes from Colossians 1 and verse 9, it says, For this reason we also, since the day we heard it, do not cease to pray for you, and to ask that you may be filled with the knowledge of his will and all wisdom and spiritual understanding, that you may walk worthy of the Lord, fully pleasing him, being fruitful in every good work and increasing in the knowledge of God, strengthened with all might, according to his glorious power, for all patience and long suffering, with joy, giving thanks to the Father who has qualified us to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in the light. He has delivered us from the power of darkness and conveyed us into the kingdom of the son of his love in whom we have redemption through his blood the forgiveness of sins so praise the lord that's my prayer for you for us uh that's our, my prayer for you um is that we will increase and in, and be filled with the knowledge of his will and all wisdom and spiritual understanding and uh praise god god bless you have an awesome day i uh, will see you at church praise the lord